guys, this video is for entertainment purposes only. This, this is our humor. We have a lot of tongue-in-cheek, dry humor. If you don't get it, then just move on to a different channel. And it, this is all in good fun. We're not actually trying to hurt anybody. No. Although we are very serious when we say, just knock off the hate. Stop mm -hmm. the hate. Just, I mean, as Ken Cole says, just stop it. Just, come on. We have to put politics aside and do what's best for our country and what's for each other and stop being so selfish. And that's really what the goal of this video is. It's not to be cruel to anybody. But if you come after us or you come after your friends, then we're going to have to take that seriously and let you know that we are not okay with it, as any good friend would do. So... Rachel and Rhea and we're the Gala sisters. We're actually Irish twins. Yeah, which means we're 15 months apart or less. So we've got a really interesting video for you guys today. Did you hear something? Maybe it was Mike Pence's fly, but I definitely heard something. I, I don't know. Anyways, so today we're going to be discussing something that has been weighing heavily on our hearts. Wait, 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 it happened again. <laughs> I, I definitely heard something that time. Yeah. Anyways, before whatever the hell... Wait. That was. What was that? Someone's trying to interrupt our broadcast, I think. Okay, well... This is a super important topic. Someone who has been bothering a lot of people, you know how it is. Okay, who was that? I don't know. Are we... I Parallel dimensions, maybe? I think we should just start our video. So on that note, well... My God, what a flop, flopping loser. He literally was like, oh my God, Andrew, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, he yelled at me. Oh my God, who the hell cares? You were yelled at by a politician that I don't even see the yelling that a apparently took place. He went and jumped on Andrew like flies on shit when the, all the allegations went down, which seems very suspicious to me. He is currently serving as a New York State Assemblyman. 
But you want to know something? He can never be president. <gasps> Why? Because he was actually born in Korea. He didn't actually make it to New York until he was seven. So if you have aspirations of being president, Mr. Kim, mm, this is not the line of work for you. There's only so far you can go, ha ha. Oh my god, he is such a frip flopping loser. He went to Riverdale Country Day School, and guess what? He was the captain of both the track team and the football team, and you wound up as an assemblyman. Wow. Why are you not, like, in the, um, I don't know, like, why are you not running, like, cross country for, like, the country, like, in, like, the Olympics, or why you're not in the NFL? I don't know. Probably because he can't do it. Probably because he's a lame loser who want to be loser. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, he's from, he's a little boy, and he's from Queens. Yeah, he understands from Queens, too. Wow, congratulations. Do you want a flip-flop and, like, gluten-free, dairy-free cookie? Is that what you we want? We probably have a few extra that you can't have because I want to eat them. Did you know that he actually does have a um, license, or a, he did graduate from college? Wow, what does anybody graduate from college? Oh my god, he have, so he from two different colleges. He mm -hmm. went to Hamilton College like Miss Bennett herself did. I wonder if they knew each other. And he also went to Chu Hamilton. What's up with the people that are graduating? He also went to from Barack, Barack College as part of the Urban National Honor Fellowship, where he was like sponsored by like some like education Chicago thing. Wow, I love no one. Who cares? And like the awesome Eric Adams, he's into on like a housing committee. And oh, look at me! Housing is so important. But actually, the only thing that I think is important to you is harassing people on Twitter. He didn't even report that he had it. one of his. Apartments or houses or something. Mm. And Jacob pulled a probe on him. <gasps> um, so Hot kettle black. What did you like? Oh, and that nail salon thing from 2015. Oh. Yeah, what's up with the nail salon thing? So you helped pass this law, this bill, and then you ended up not liking it because your people didn't like it. Now you're blaming Andrew, and now you're upset with Andrew because he can't overturn it. So... He like he and he was also there when Spencer got in trouble. Yes, so let's talk about that. Spencer. Hmm. Spencer was also another disgraced governor, governor who had like one of like like prostitute allegations or mm -hmm. something. And Ron Kim's stink is all over. Yeah, he worked for Ron. Ron Kim worked for him mm -hmm. before he worked for the New York State Building Project. Wow. So, why? Why does it seem to follow you? Why do these harassment claims seem to follow you? It seems like you're doing something. Did you know that he endorsed Bernie Sanders and Andy Gay? Far left. You um, know the only blue MAGA out there are the far left? Didn't he call like one of our friends blue MAGA and all he yeah. ever does? He like, actually tweet, 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 tweet. He's trying to compete with former Mr. King Twitter, who is no longer on Twitter, and the former guy, Donald J. Trump, who are acting just like him. Hey, Twitter, please take this guy's account down. He's an idiot. If you're going to take down Trump's account, then you got to take down Ron Kim's account. You know what amazes me? He had an I think he's having an affair with the <gasps> Why would you say that? Because, you know, on his Twitter appeared some pictures of, oh, I don't know, him and Biagi horseback riding on the beach. Aren't they both? Aren't he and Biagi both married? Yeah. But those have mysteriously disappeared. Mm. 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 So, Rob, I think that you need to face what you've done. I think that you need to hear your own tweets and your own words and let everybody know what's going on. Because all you do is you go on and you pick fights. And you know what? You can't pick fights on us on Twitter because we blocked you. Ooh. And if you try to comment on this video, we'll remove your comments. So we can sit here and talk about how terrible you are because you're nothing but a little spoiled, overgrown child. And there ain't anything you can do about it. Oh, maybe if you emailed us or something, we might allow you on the channel to be interviewed by us, and we would love to talk to you and cross-examine you. And then we'll edit it so you look like a moron. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe how stupid this man is. This man is to be, like, taken back to Korea or something. I don't understand. Why would you ever hurt someone?
little boys, <laughs> boy and queen, leave our friends alone. Leave them alone. Stop it. Knock it off. What are you, two? You need to be putting a time out for a very, very, very long time. You are not acting like an adult. You are a shame to American people. Stop it. Well, hmm, let's see. He's sitting here harassing Chris Cuomo. Uh, I think the former guy did that. Mm-hmm. Didn't he? He has multiple tweets saying he doesn't hate Andrew Cuomo. Yes, you do. You are obsessed with him. Honey, bitch, you're a fan. You're also like, what did he like reject you or something? That's what it sounds like. Mm, did you like send him like a date proposal and it was and you put a lot of money into it, you planned it, and he said no, and now you're just taking it out on the whole entire world. Stop calling our friends blue maga. Please. The only blue maggot here is you. The only one acting like Trump narcissist is you. <laughs> you are so worthless. So nobody ever gonna love you. You flushed your political career down the toilet for what? A petty argument? Mm -hmm. What kind of loser can sit there on Twitter and bash someone who outranks them? If you had any other job, you would be immediately fired. And in fact, if I was in charge of the Democrats in New York, I would be calling you every day saying, stop, 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 stop. <sighs> what a horrible human being. Just Horrible. You don't like people calling you names. Well, then stop talking with you. Wow, you had someone die in a nursing home. Oh my god, maybe you missed the Ways and Means um, uh, decision that they made on the. That Trump was in charge of that, not Andrew. Not Andrew. Why are you pinning Trump's crimes on Andrew Cuomo? This doesn't make any sense. Are you friends with Donald Trump? Because sure as hell, you I look like, like it. Mm. You are nothing and nobody to me. <laughs> what do you not like gay people? Do you not like lesbians? Do you not support the lesbians and the LGBTQIA plus community? Because I don't think you do. I'm looking at your Twitter and I'm not seeing anything about that. That's great. You support Asians and you should because Asian hate is always wrong and nobody should ever attack you for that. However, I don't see any pride things on yours. No, and you probably are going to attack me after Yeah. It doesn't matter which one. You are spreading nothing but hate throughout the entire world and you need to shut up. <laughs> you are such a nobody. You do realize nobody cares your opinion on anything. And you just spread hate and animus. Why are you spreading hate animus? So let's talk about this. He says that, oh, oh, I'm gonna cry. He yelled at me and he made me cry and he made my wife cry when I you know what I bet? I bet the only person making your wife cry is you. <laughs> because I used to be married to someone like you, and I worked with men like you, and they're jerks. And you are trying to gaslight everyone while we see through it. <laughs> Trump was such a gaslighter. Mm -hmm. You're trying to pin your crimes on Andrew Cuomo, and we would love to do that entire transcript of that phone call. And Andrew did not say anything that you said he did, and Melissa DeRosa backed him up. So one of you is lying. Why do you harass Melissa DeRosa anyways? Do you just, I think the only person here who hates women is you. The only person here who discriminates against single people is you. And you are such a loser. And you just have to, I don't know, go to hell maybe. And we really didn't want to acknowledge you on this channel because you're nothing to us. But apparently you just cannot leave our friends alone. And when you don't leave our friends alone, then we have a serious problem. Because we stand united against you. I don't know who you are. I don't know where you came from. I don't know anything about you. All I know is that you are a moron. You don't even belong as a greeter at the porta potty. No, actually, I think, why don't you, like, we're going to drag you to hell because we don't mind being there. We don't mind being there. And you say believe all women. Guess what, honey? People lie. And that includes women. You have to investigate these things. Oh, you're not even sure I'm notorious. Like, you wouldn't know that. It just sounds like you're jealous of Andrew Cuomo. Perhaps you got rejected and you also want to sit there and have what he has. And you're also picking on someone who may be upset because he just went through a very bitter breakup. What are you, friends with Janice Dean? Mm -hmm. And 
we've gone through breakups before and we've been picked on before for being down because that happens sometimes when you get out of long relationships and people don't like single people. So what Smiths do this? Stop trying to open a Jayco Pro that's already closed. You're trying to reopen it. Look, oh, what he 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 left it. He, he put it all out in the open. You and Biagi and your little friend Rivera like won't even shut up about it. Wow. The only reason why you are against Andrew is because you are against people. 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 Except for yourself. What is self-serving for me? Should I just wear a mirror? Because maybe then you might notice me. Mm-hmm. I'd be happy to do that. And we will never tweet you because we don't rub, we don't roll around in the dirt with the garbage. I was gonna say, or the dog poop. Mm-hmm. Your dog poop was pick you up in the trash. If I didn't come anywhere near you, I might end up smelling forever, and I don't want that. So let's all do this. Let's all make this like decision that we're gonna vote for Stephen Lee, mm -hmm. who is running against you. So, I don't know if you and your Cuomo supporters were a part of the resistance that helped get Biden elected, which we were a part of, and that's actually the reason why we started this channel. And what we did was we ended up blocking a lot of maggots, which is exactly what you should do with a maggot. You should block them. So let's all go out there and let's block Ron T. Kim together and let's ignore him so that he turns into just a pile of rubbish and ash and becomes what he should be, which is nothing. He's a nobody and he doesn't matter. Do you have anything else to say about this loser? The worst thing you could possibly do is ignore someone. So we're going to acknowledge him on this channel where he can't touch us and where he can't respond, where he can just squirm and cry and listen to us defend ourselves. And she and I, we don't go after people unless there's a reason, unless you come after us first. You come after our friends, so that's good enough. Mm -hmm. Do not mess with our friends. Or and we consider Andrew and Chris our friends. Or these people will come back out again. And no, Andrew and Chris did not ask us to make this. No, they don't even know about They this. don't, we don't actually really, we're not close to them or anything like that. And we're not being paid for them. In fact, we're not being paid at all to do this. No, this stuff is all free. So mm -hmm. those people who are walking around saying we're being, we're being paid to do this, please shut up. Please, knock it off. You and your lives are not going to get you anywhere. No, they're not. So, you know what? Let's stop talking about this stupid loser oh, and his little God. friends. Gustavo Rivera and um, Biagi. Biagi and then Yulene Yalvich. And uh, yeah, that's it. We're not done talking about shit anymore. You don't matter. Bye. Bye. Oh, God. <laughs> We have I would not want to be that Ron Kim Assemblyman guy. No, our evil twins no. are apparently trying. Hi. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, when did God. We, when did we get evil twins? When did that happen? Where were they? I don't even remember doing that. There was sitting here at one point. Why did they do that? I don't know. That was super creepy. Oh my god, it's almost like you pushed our evil twins too far and they just took over our channel. Yeah. Oh my god. Who are... Oh my god, who are they going to deal with next? I don't know, but there's a lot of people, especially in New York State, who might deserve that. I would probably not mess with our evil gala twins. No. That's probably just not a good idea. No. Okay. I'm starting to calm down. Yeah. Okay. That was really creepy. I've never seen it. I didn't know that that existed. It's almost like Ryan Murphy took over our channel and started directing it. It was weird. That was just messed up. I mean, obviously, 
they know who we are and they know that we were here. You know, now that I think about it, I think that I had seen some of those clips floating around social media. Okay, so next time I start seeing clips like that, that are on social media, I am going to remember to take note of what happens on the date that it says that this is going to happen. Because I don't think they're done. I don't want to miss the next one. No. No. And neither do you. Nobody wants to. No. Um, so I I think we're gonna go like cry in a corner now because that was like really scary and um we're just gonna we're gonna do our normal ending and then go from here, okay? So I guess whatever that was we're gonna end whatever that was here. Um, I guess if you guys liked the creepy evil weirdo twin thingies, huh, give it a big thumbs up. I guess if you didn't like the evil twins trying to go after people, maybe don't give it a thumbs down because I don't know what they would do to you. Uh, the next thing I'd probably recommend doing is uh, smashing that subscribe button down below so we can monetize this channel. I mean, what are we at, like 580-ish now? Something like that. Yeah. So let's um, try to get it to 1,000 so we can monetize this channel and we can turn on super chats and we can start... Um, having video sponsors, then I might uh, go down below and I might, uh, if you dare, ring that bell and click all so that you always know whenever we go live or whenever we post videos, generally we post videos every Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. A lot of times on Saturdays there is a live action rally. Want to find us on Tuesdays? Well, you can do that now because we have a podcast called Gavin with the Gala Sisters. On Twitter, you can find us at the Gala Sisters. On Instagram, you can find us at the Gala Fam. And on Facebook, you can find us at the Gala Sisters. And make sure that you are sharing these videos with your friends so that they don't miss the next sighting of the evil Gala Sister twins. And um, we also have a wonderful website at www.thegalasisters.com where we have three blogs. Maybe the evil twins will make um, an appearance over there. Who knows? You never know. You'll have to just see. Um, I, I, I have nothing else to say. <laughs> Bye!